After almost 10 months of wandering the gorgeous landscape, Rockstar and our 60 bucks have delivered onto us with Red Dead Redemption 2. I have yet to get tired of horsing around in this game. <laughs> Today, folks, while we're waiting for the next update, I'm tackling the Goldilocks Challenge, where you have to kill and skin three bears without dying yourself. As we all know, if you aren't hunting or griefing, any cowboy or cow gal worth their salt knows you're clawing, scrimping, and collecting for one goal, to look like a grade A badass. Nice. While the exact definition of that description would depend upon personal taste, luckily, if you've seen my previous videos, I've already provided a few options to pursue. If none of these tickle your fancy, I got another hat and weapon combo lined up for you. You don't even have to kill anyone. It's all unguarded. Great news for all the activists and pacifists in the audience. Might I humbly present myself for the new viewers out there as the one and only Hudson is Prime, purveyor of movie theories and loot tutorials. As soon as I get my last bear ski without getting flayed, I'm gonna show you how to get the Civil War hardy hat and knife. Oh, wintergreen berry. You know I can never find these damn things when I need to. Excuse me a second. And with that, folks, we've completed the Goldilocks Challenge. Now let's go find your new hat and pig sticker. To begin your search, I recommend being St. Denis adjacent. The location holding your new swag is going to be just north of RDR2's Bayou City. We're going to be heading for an abandoned Civil War fort near the Mossy Flats. As mentioned previously, you shouldn't face much resistance from the ghosts of this place. The only fighting you may find is loudmouth gang members looking for that one-way ticket to Jesus. You look like you might need a few smacks to set you straight. Once you're in the side of the fort, head towards the southern portion. There'll be a pretty large gate you can get through, plus another secret way. Oh, hold up here. Freeze, Conker. Did you see that damn squirrel try to steal our hat and knife? Little bastard. Well, now that, that asshole's dead. Hit the southern wall, and while you could use the gates, I prefer to sneak around when I'm looting, so I'm going through this hole in the wall. After you penetrate the outer defenses, Head towards the Callista Flockhart statue. I'm a huge fan of your work, Miss McBeal. Tell Han Solo I said what's up. From here, head to the busted cabin just west of your current position. Head inside and you'll find a secret cellar that'll hold your prizes. Ooh, trading card. Black Panther. You know, those Marvel movies are pretty good. I can't wait for them to get made. In the northernmost portion of the cabin, against the back wall, you'll find your ladder into the creepy basement, and I promise, no furnaces. <laughs> Hit the ground, and right smack dab in the middle of the space on a stack of crates, you'll see your Civil War knife complete with knuckle duster gleaming bright, just waiting for your grubby mitts. Once you got a hold of that, littered across the room, you'll find boxes of ammo, and against the western wall, you'll find an old chest that holds a Civil War report and a nugget of gold. I may hate reading, but I love spending. Once you five finger discounted everything inside that chest, just to your left on the floor will be the crowning gem of our adventure. Now it can be difficult to see the hat in game. Honestly, I just shuffled around in the corner until the pickup hat icon made itself known. And that, my friends, is how you get yourself a hardy hat and a knife. Now let's get the hell out of this basement while I still have some of my lungs left. It's only chapter four, after all. What, too soon? That's been ten months, people. Thank you again for another successful video, and if y'all don't mind, I'd like to celebrate the way I celebrate all my videos, with a little whistle wetting and knuckle dusting. Wait till you see him get a load of my new hat. Hey, asshole! Howdy. Bars open. What the? 
What do you think of my new hat, turd yeah, burglar? I'd rather eat turd than talk to any one of you. Don't you recognize me? And I've done it. I eat and turd. Had to out on the trail. You don't even recognize me. I might have just a ticket to kick his memory into high gear. We'll sure as hell like this one. Now let's try. Uh, excuse, excuse you. Mr. The hell? Hello, barkeep. I'd like a beer, please. Yeah, that's more like it. Let's dance. Oh, you brought some of your common friends to help you fight dirty, huh? Well, go on, I'll take on all three! Ooh. Smell nice. Do you use dove soap? Here you go! Dodge this. Hold it right there. All right. Now that I kicked his ass, I'd like to thank y'all again for watching. All right, barkeep, I think I'll take that beer now. As soon as I can get my coons. Oh, hell, I'll get it later. Thank you all for watching. Please be sure to like if you found this video helpful or entertaining. And subscribe to help a cowboy out. If you want to see more Red Dead content more often, please let me know in the comments below. You want to see me find you a new weapon or fancy hat? Let me know what you're looking for in the comments and I'll see what I can do. It's always a pleasure to have your company while I'm looting the West, so thank you again for tuning in. Until next time, folks, good luck in your day and Godspeed. Yeah!